welcome this is vishnu and uh, ssic tech talk uh, concept is on application of soft skills and ssic stands for uh, soft skills and interpersonal communication skills let's get started so why do we even need soft skills and why are they so important so these four skills are also are also known as people skills communication skills character or personality traits attitude and job attitudes which are all fall under the umbrella of soft skills where people skills include how you deal with people and communication skills how you communicate how you exchange ideas uh, with uh, via voice medium or air medium with the help of voice and uh, character how you behave and uh, your personality and your attitude uh, how you react respond and job attributes which may include your dress etiquette or your table etiquette etc so these are known as soft skills and people with social and emotional intelligence are better equipped uh, to navigate their surroundings this means that they may think uh, what kind of replies could uh, impact on others view point a view a point of view uh, on a particular situation or on a particular argument and etc so uh, these skills will come in hand uh, when dealing with people and complementing hard skills allows you to work successfully with others and achieving your goals and this says that uh, with the help of good soft skills uh, we can exchange our values or ideas when while especially working in as a team so if there is any something is wrong then you can state it uh, like uh, something is wrong which is uh, not so defensive or not so aggressive in a uh, manner which may lead to disaster or uh, uh, it may not be considered uh, something which is good uh, so it should be in a such a way that others will accept it that yes it's a mistake and that needs to be clarified or uh, that needs to be sorted out so uh, these are the uh, nothing but the skills which are required to be uh, good at teams and how may these ability how may these abilities be put to use so an ability can only be acquired when it's done so when practically done then uh, these skills uh, can be acquired or we can say um, be good at it because something which is done uh, gives you experience rather than just knowing about it so the ability which can only be acquired when it's done so uh, doing is nothing but uh, in case of soft skills it's speaking to others and uh, being in teams working as a team member or being a leader or uh someone who states something is wrong and uh, like how you deal with people and how you behave and how you dress and which is nothing but dress etiquette in a uh, corporate or office or colleges so if one puts something into action then they will uh do it better rather than just reading about something or listening to something else uh, as a research states that uh, readers uh, did achieve less marks uh, than who uh, did written practice or who wrote them so the level of comfort uh, will actually decrease how much how effective you gather the data so when you practice something there is effort that's put in so it we can state that it will be way more efficient rather than just writing about something so 
that is how it is and language can be improved by interacting with others which already stated as in the above uh, point that we need to do something to get something so working in teams is also same uh, working in teams dealing with people dealing with members uh, worst case scenario politics as well and uh, exchanging views ideas thoughts uh, improvements uh, if there is anything wrong as stated before uh, if anything is wrong addressing them in a way that someone the other person won't get defensive about it but understands it and uh, uh, progresses towards uh, resolving it or resolving the problem and uh, that is how uh, you can state working in teams and effective time management uh, where by managing time we can do more things or we can do things or do any kind of uh, daily chores or anything effectively but not in such a way that more things can be get done but the things uh, which are planned may complete uh, as they planned so what are the resources that are needed to accomplish this so one of the things is that it's preferred uh, to fail sooner than rather than later so why because in the beginning stages uh, there will be uh, less to nothing to lose but uh, as time progresses in particular domain or field or whatever it is responsibilities or you can say uh, other attributes or variables which will be so strong that one failure may lead to uh, the downfall of all other variables as well so it is said that it's uh, practice uh, you will obviously because it start you will fail and uh, the thing over here is to uh, know about it uh, what made uh, it to fail what was the attribute or what is the variable that uh, resulted in this failure and uh, resolving it uh, will make sense rather than uh, pointing out the failure and open-minded people are capable of critical thinking problem solving and innovation why because open-minded people are open for views and ideas and uh, they think from each and every perspective of a situation they won't stick to one particular situation but to many because they know that so many variables do influence and there are variables which are unknown to influence the any kind of situation so open-minded people can be uh, will be better at critical thinking because uh, there will be a cases where a last minute you need to make a decision and it's been done and that correct decision will be done by these kind of people problem solving and also innovation innovation is different from invention where innovation is something uh, where existing product will be will be equipped with uh, uh, with other technologies or upgrade in the existing technology may lead to innovation where invention is something which is completely different which has been created so innovation can also be done by these open minded people because they look at uh, things from each and every aspect from each and every corner which leads them to think differently and uh, do something so uh, these are the resources which are required for a individual uh, to uh, acquire or obtain or equip equip uh, him or herself with uh, these soft skills and that's it thank you